All right, Capricorns, let me get you um, position. Oh, righty, Capricorns. Wow, that's a lot of money. <laughs> All right, so Capricorns, congratulations. Mm -mm -mm. That's about time, Capius. What a beautiful, beautiful scenery. Ooh, okay. All right, Capricorns, you, you begin this period with the Ten of Cups, and this is very positive. Whatever you are doing at the workplace, a lot of you are very positive, okay? Um, whatever that has been transpiring, even though you're going through some sort of a hardship or emotionally um, instability at the workplace, you're you're trying to figure out the best way. Because it's as if a lot of you Capricorns are saying, hey, this is, um, um, this is, and you have congratulations because you have the sun in Capricorn. You have the sun in Capricorn. So whether it's at the workplace or whether it's business, you have the sun in Capricorn and you have the Pisces, uh, um, um, the energy of uh, happiness and joy within yourself, okay? Because this is uh, Saturn. And the problem is that Capricorn, no matter what it is, uh, three of pentacles, you're ending this May being victorious and successful, okay? Because you're going to be recognizing you know, what has been transpiring and happening around you. Who are these people? Who are your colleagues? How they they influence you and your progress moving forward? Um, Your business, okay? And I see for business people, and especially women, um, that are business people, people are going to be recognizing your work, okay? Um, because people are going to be now recognizing that this person has a lot of expertise, so, okay? And they're going to be recognizing your work. The sun is in Capricorn, congratulations. So Capricorns, whatever is happening in business and career in this uh, month, uh, and whatever you're going to be finding out, you are going to be... um. A financial stability. The nine of pentacles is at the bottom. The nine um, of pentacles is about financial stability. So, you know, if even you're fired, if even that people are stealing from your business and whatever, it is going to be balancing out, okay? Now, if you recognize the weeks, it's all pentacles except the first week because the first week of May is when you're going to be recognizing some sort of an unconventional situation that was transpiring within your business or on the work floor. Things are going to be revealed to you, okay? So things about colleagues, okay, colleagues that has been, been some sort of a obstacles, to you, obstacles um, within your business, people that was creating a whole lot of obstacles. It, the month of May for you, Capricorns, is going to be the, the, the month that you're going to be running with it. You have the Six of Pentacles. You have the Five of Pentacles. After the Five, it goes back to the Four, which you are going to be end this, the, ending this month with financial stability in May. Um... Uh, Business that was stolen from you, um, position that was stolen from you, doors that was closed is now going to be open because people are going to be uh, walking with you and helping to open this, okay? So I professional people, I see even people who are in a service, um, you know, people are going to be looking at your work and recognizing how um, very professional you are. And how you, whether you are in service or you're in work beans or whatever, you ex you 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 excel for perfection, and because of that, you're going to be attracting more business to you. Okay, you're going to be recognizing that a Taurus has been your greatest enemy or calm the down. Whoever this Taurus is and whatever is transpiring, this Taurus, a lot of you are going to be recognizing that a Pisces, a Libran, a Taurus, Pisces, Libran, Taurus, another young Capricorn, whether this uh, um, other young Capricorn person is, has been creating a whole lot of issues, okay? 
And whoever this young Capricorn is was trying to get away with a lot of money. And they're going to be finding out this person because if you notice, um, a young Capricorn tried to play some of you older people, okay? So it's as if some of you older people run a business and they're going to be recognizing that this young Capricorn, um, this is the energy of the two of swords and this young Capricorn, I see some sort of a hardship is now. So you young Capricorns, you got to be aware. If you're working in a family business, uh, you young Capricorns, they're going to be trying to derail you out of a family business, okay? Uh, so you got to be aware of this. So young Capricorns, be aware. Young Capricorns, um, some sort of information is going to be coming out and they're going to be recognizing that you young Capricorns had collaborated with a Taurus in order to accumulate a whole lot of wealth. However you have worked with the Taurus, you and the Taurus is going to be finding yourself in some real financial hardship. For the rest of you older people, I see that you are going to be building on and uh, um, new business, new work is going to be coming in. Extra work that is going to be bringing extra promotion, extra business into your world. You're ending this uh, May um, with the three of wheels. Um, ending this May going to be connecting, collaborating and connecting. All right. So um, with networking, collaborating with other people is going to be creating a huge, huge success, both for you and other people. All right. So Capricorn, I think this period of working in a team, I know some of you don't like teamwork, but you can actually close off the people and focus on your work. Okay. Make sure don't sell and give people ideas because I see a lot of you Capricorns had a whole lot of ideas, but people are just looking to listen to what is your ideas and use it. So we have the energy of the Ten of Cups and the energy of the Ten of Cups is the energy of uh, um you recognizing that some of you recognize, you know, I'm with the right people. I am connecting with the right people. This person feel as if uh, I am at home with this person. And by that, uh, you're going to be working together in collaboration and creating a whole lot of wealth and stability. So this is really positive. It's, you know, it is a situation where you are positively um, recreating for yourself and bringing yourself and accepting the sun in Capricorn. And the sun in Capricorn is about you Capricorns recognize you don't need friends on the work floor. You just need to get the, the things done and you need to work in a team. And when you get out, work is behind you and you relax at home. A lot of you, um, this is in the cross, young Capricorns, they're going to be recognizing that you had collaborated with a Taurus in order to uh, create a lot of money. And uh, if this was a side business that you were doing with a Taurus, people are going to be finding out about this. Okay, so be aware. Let's look at the first week. The first week of uh, um, this season, a whole lot of information is going to be coming out about a family, a family business, and what a family has done. Okay, so it could be a family business that a lot of you have worked in, or you could be doing some sort of an investigation and recognizing what um, customer service have done to a family, how a family has been distorted of a lot of money, but it has something to do with family, okay? And this is going to be God. Then we recognize in the second week, the six of uh, uh, wheels and the six of wheels is about help. New doors of opportunity is going to be opening up for a lot of you Capricorns. And this is going to be good. Um, in the second week, it's going to be absolutely positive because it is going to be some sort of a promotion or it is going to be where people are going to be sent to your business because they recognize that you are on top of your game and you are aware of the laws, rules, and regulation, and people are going to be sent to you and sent to your business, or they're going to be saying, hey, Capricorn, we see that you have been doing a good job. We are going to be doing some cuts and give you more work. Are you capable of thinking on this work? Yes, Capricorn is ready. 
in the third week the energy of the five of pentacles is uh, um a lot of you are going to be recognizing that a taurus have pulled you down the wrong rabbit hole whether the taurus is has been having some sort of uh you could have been collaborating with a Taurus. You could have think that a Taurus was your best eyelids, but it's going to be recognizing whoever the Taurus is was your worst eyelid. So you will find this out as you go along. You can work with people for a long time and never know exactly what idea these people have in their heads about you Capricorns. And this is what is going to be happening is that you're going to be really finding out who is a Capric who is a Taurus and why a Taurus had connected with you and how a Taurus had bring you down and it's going to be a hard rock it's going to be between the rock and a hard place for a lot of you um Capricorns in this uh, um third week and it's going to be affecting young Capricorns, okay? Young people between the age of uh, of 19 and 50. Um, it is going to be affecting you because a whole lot of information is going to be coming out that you young Capricorns had something to do with the, the disappearance or um, that the creditors or debitor didn't pay or you did not pay a client or a customer that should have been paid. Where is the money? Okay, that sort of a thing. And you could have just forget, okay? The fourth week is good, especially for business people. The fourth week is going to be powerful. The fourth week is going to be um, where the month has end and you're recognizing so much money that is coming into you, okay? At the end of this month of May, a lot of you Capricorns are going to be very, very financial stable. And especially if you are a business person, you are going to be getting a lot of business because people are going to be recognizing, hey, this person is who I want to, you know, do my business. This person is the person that is bringing um, the, a positive shift in my department, a positive shift in my corporation, a positive shift. And I see that um, you Capricorn is as if a lot of people have their eyes on you and is watching and is looking at your work, but is a, a sense of jealousy, you know, the eyes um, where it is a form of jealousy. They, they recognize how good you are and that can kill a lot of people. So I see that you Capricorns is as if, uh, you know, your world is about to open up. But it's as if you're getting so much. It's as if you are, by just one thing, you open up so many Pandora boxes at the workplace. Just finding out that one situation, one process wasn't working, that flip, and that this has been going on and on and on. And people are going to be recognizing, oh my God, it's a good thing the Capricorn found out what was transpiring. Oh my gosh. And you know, they are going to be recognizing, hey, this person, we need to send more people to this um, Capricorn or we need to send more clients. We need to send more customers to this Capricorn. Capricorn um, has been helping people. And through that Capricorn, you are really, um, the sun is going to be in Capricorn in your position because because of the recognizing, you're looking at the basis and the little things and detail they are going to be recognizing, hey, this Capricorn is the person that needs to be. So a lot of you Capricorn, high professional or um, non-Capricorns who are dealing detailed work, detailed job, this is what is going to transpire. People are going to be picking you up. You know, people, Capricorns who are really orientated and detail, the details, that is what is going to be giving you a run for this month and this is where you're going to be picking up in 2021 and recognize it hey you know you know the 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 uh, the imperfection of who i think i am is going to be helping me um to process me and take me on so you know i, I who you have to deal with a libran a pisces a libran another Capricorn, but this is a young Capricorn that is has been creating a whole lot of problem. But I see hardship is coming up because they're going to be recognizing that this young Capricorn have 
I don't be wasting the family um, business money or has uh, waste their own money or took money on the, however it is. And then I see a lot of you are, you know, people are going to be trusting you with their business. And this is good Capricorn. Once people are going to be trusting you with their business, um, this is going to be good because people are going to be coming to you to resolve whatever is transpiring. Oh. So Capricorn, it's going to be beautiful. There is no question about it. It is going to be a beautiful month. The sun is in um, your position of the month. And this is going to be good. So whatever business-wise, Capricorn, use the energy. Use the energy that is going on. Because this is going to be taking you a far way. Capricorn, follow me to the other side. If not, it's just a dollar ninety nine. Capricorn, come check out. Follow me. Come check out and see what is going to be coming up for this um this uh, this period because it's going to be helping you to resolve um the issues that is going to be coming up and you're going to be snapping them out of the way. So come follow me to the other side. And it's a dollar ninety nine. It's not. It's for the month. You can watch everything in the archive. I do love you. I'm moving forward. Namaste.